My name is Ashley Meschke, and I'm Product Specialist at Atlas Copco. In today's video, we'll be going over how to set tightening torque on a pneumatic nut runner. Let's head over to the pneumatic experience room. Setting torque on a pneumatic nut runner is very similar to setting torque on a pneumatic screwdriver. Today, we're using an LTV 29-2 R30-10, which has a torque range of 15 to 30 newton meters. The tightening torque is adjusted by altering the tension of the clutch spring. Turn the protection ring until the hole in the clutch housing is free. Then, turn the outgoing spindle until you can see the keyhole in the adjustment washer. Turn the adjustment key clockwise to decrease and counterclockwise to increase the torque. After the adjustment, turn the protective ring back again. As you can see, there's no way for us to know what torque this tool is set at. To accurately set a target torque, a transducer must be used. So let's see what torque we're at using an IRTT and our ST pad. We're a little bit above our target torque, so let's go ahead and reduce our target. So let's go ahead and check what we are at now that we've made an adjustment. And as you can see, we've definitely lowered our torque. We're now at 19.71. This is within the bounds of my application. So I know that this tool can now go out onto the line. And with that, you now know how to set torque on a pneumatic nut runner. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to your local Alice Kopka representative. Thank you and see you next time.